That's between uh, Zhao Lixiu and Han Rechei Netsiri, and I hope I said that right. So there are archers from Thailand and from China. You did better on that than I would have, Pippa. One of the, the home team boys in the crowd is getting into the cheers. The gentleman from China, silver medalist from the Rio 2016 Paralympic Games, and also won the uh, Bangkok World Championships in 2013, so four years ago. But uh, he's, uh, he's obviously been an active archer since, so I think this could be a very good match. Qualified number eight to get here. He qualified, uh, our um, gentleman from Thailand qualified in sixth place, and uh, Zhao from China qualified in eighth place. So Zhao also is a Paralympic medalist from Rio with the team, and uh, also he got a bronze medal in Team World Championships in 2015. So both of these gentlemen are uh, multiple medalists in Paralympic Games and World Championships. We should see a competitive match here then. Seems to be some discussion going on on the field. I think we're ready, but the coach from China or Thailand, I'm sorry, the coach from Thailand seems to be looking for some type of equipment. Ah, finger sling. I think that's not what he needs, is that little bit of added pressure of uh, losing his finger sling on the, on the way to the gold medal match. We've been given the start signal. That match is underway. And being the first ar archer to shoot as well, that adds the pressure. Yes. At least his coach had a spare. And he didn't let it face him. <laughs> Maybe he was thinking about the finger sling rather than his nerves. <laughs> nice start, nice start. <laughs> Good start. <laughs> both both wow. men nice shooting group. quickly, oh. confidently. One click to the right and they'd both be in the turn. Mm -hmm. He moved his sight just the tiniest amount. <laughs> Set points are tied. Do you know, I often get asked whether or not there's a disadvantage to being uh, somebody who shoots from a wheelchair or somebody who shoots standing position and, and whether there's actually a, a difference and whether it's easier for one person or another. And yet here we have a gold medal match. We have one standing archer, one wheelchair archer, and their scores are, si uh, their scores are tied. Which I guess says it all, really. It's down to the skill of the archer. And you make you make the what uh, you make the best of what you've got. Yeah. And, and how you do that. Quick turnaround. The arrows have been confirmed. We're moving on to end number two.
that's I think that's part of the excitement of individual and or the the, the match the, the head to head elimination oh my goodness <laughs> almost yeah. dead center nearly nearly got the spider as we call it cross in the middle of the target is that uh, there's there's little downtime nice nice to nice 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 come back there's little downtime in these matches, uh, both for the competitors and the spectators. Uh, <laughs> the, yeah, excite the, yeah. the, 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 the motion of the match, the, the progress wow. of the match keeps just <laughs> right on moving. Mm -hmm. And both of these archers are shooting quite quickly uh, in addition to it being a quick format. Oh, mm -hmm. Just outside the 10. Oh, 10, 10, 10. <laughs> Woo, we haven't seen that's one what of those you yet see? this morning, have we? We haven't. That's the first. Wonderful. We'll give him the prize. All right. That's a perfect 30. <laughs> and after losing his finger sling as well. Didn't seem to have faced him. There's a shot of the crowd. Chinese. Chinese folks. support. Mm hmm. That might say hello, mum, though. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It very very well could say hello, so mom. Hi, mom. Why is it people always say hi, mom, wow. but never hi, dad? <laughs> <laughs> That's very true. Okay, arrows have come back to the archers. China, shoot first. Zhao looks very focused. And it shows. Oh. And it, it does show. Mm. Oh, he dropped low with that one. Oh. Maybe he was thinking that uh, he wanted to get a 10, and so he wasn't thinking about his process. Sometimes, as they say, when you're in the lead, you get to... Uh, Mm -hmm. some, there is sometimes a little bit of a psychological let off and you say, okay, maybe I don't have to be as exact as I have been on the past mm. couple arrows I've shot. Oh, gosh. <laughs> you know what I was saying about closing down the match and being in front, then there's that, you know, y you just feel that you need to shoot. You need to shoot tens and you lose sight of <laughs> what you're doing mm. each end. And we have our second 10, 10, 10. Oh, we have a nine line cutter, but I think it's in. <laughs> Match is tied again, I think. <laughs> see, from here, I'd definitely give that nine a 10. Okay. Remember, we're looking for the first archer to six set points. So we're, we're halfway through this match. Scores tied, three set points each. Of course, you know, if you get nervous, you get a lot of adrenaline in your system, and uh, that can make you, you know, not just butterflies in your stomach, but it can. Uh, it can make you shake, or there's all sorts of things, ways in which that can affect you. And yeah, it's not something that you really want in archery, is too much adrenaline rushing around in your system. No, you want to be in, is you want to be calm and in, in control, control as you can be. All about control. And that's part of the learning process, is to understand. Because um, a good 
sports performance professional will tell you you got to have a little bit of that anxiety yes. and pressure <laughs> yeah. to to keep you on your toes. Yeah. You don't want to just be as complacent as you can. No. So it's um, that's part of the learning process is to find out what that optimal level of arousal is for you and yeah. how much you can take and still perform mm. to your best or how mm. much you can s can be in that I'm uh, okay yeah. scenario and uh, and and not have your score slip. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. and it's a really interesting thing as well because a small amount of adrenaline actually makes your eyesight clearer and uh, your brain function faster. And having clearer eyesight in archery is worth having. <laughs> <laughs> so that mm -hmm. it improves, it improves your reflexes. All sorts of things improve with a little bit of adrenaline, but that little bit of anxiety is. It's helpful, but you just can't let it get out of control. He mm. seems to have settled, settled back down a little bit now. Uh, a small wobble. A 10. A ten. Mm. If that 9 is upgraded to a 10, then uh, we've got to tie that. They'll be tied. So we're waiting on the judge to find out whether the match is going to be tied or whether those set points that they've uh, shown preliminary are let's actually bring our correct. graphics back and let's see if we can watch that, what happens with that nine and see if it's going to Judge has been called. It was, yeah, it was worthy of a call that the judge had to come over and take a close look at it. The judge has given their decision and the score is coming back. It's a nine. Stays as it is. So the, the uh, and was so close. It was. Score is five to three in favor of Netsiri. China can win this and he can uh, bring it to a tie break, which would be a really exciting thing for us for the gold medal match just before lunch. It's a nice the last match of the day. Morning with some excitement. Wow, yeah. that's the way to start mm. that uh, campaign is with a 10. didn't look like such a great release. <laughs> it didn't look like some of his better shots. And he didn't get rewarded for it either. No. He wasn't so happy with that release either. Mm. Quite a bit of body English on that, <laughs> on the follow through <laughs> on that one. Yeah. And, the facial and now he's practicing his shot for the next end. Mental rehearsal mm. and uh, and, and adding some even physical movements into that rehearsal are great ways to get right back into your shot process. It shows he's done some good mental training as well. It's I think nine. that's an eight. An eight. Mm. Well, it's just outside the, the nine. The spotters put it down as questionable, so it could be a nine. That's here. He's going to have to have a ten. Which he doesn't. So Zhao has tied the match. Maybe we shouldn't have actually asked for that because we're putting them under more pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Set points, five ball. We come into a tiebreaker situation. Yeah, right. And in an individual match, the tiebreaker is one arrow. If the score of the arrows are the same, then it is the arrow closest to center that will win the match. If the arrows are within a millimeter of the distance from the center, both archers, then, then we'll shoot another arrow. I've seen it happen. I've actually been in a, in a match where I've officiated and I've got my calipers out and, and measured it. And it's been exact, the exact same distance from two archers shooting at a distance of 70 meters away. 
to, to think that both both archers come within the the same, just not even not even half a millimeter of yeah. of being uh, yeah, different. That has happened to me in a match uh, at 50 meters with a compound, and um, we had to shoot a second one, and the second one was really really close as well. Uh, but um, got called in my favour, so my lucky day. <laughs> Both of these archers will have practiced these single arrow shoots offs back at oh. their training center, and, but it's not quite the same as when you're in the in the big arena. And neither of them has been in this situation in any of the earlier ma rounds, so they're a little bit untested on these single arrow shoot offs in the, in this competition. Zhao is up first. I'm sorry. Netsiri is up first. Oh, and he gets a 10. <laughs> That's a great shot. Now what can Zhao do in response? A gold medal decided on one arrow. Oh, it's also a 10. But I think... I think Zhao has it. I think Zhao has it. I wow can remember where how far away <laughs> that series zero was from. Wow, the that is the center of the fantastic of the shooting. Center. Oh, and look at them. Uh, I think they know it as yeah. well. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> it's been confirmed. Zhao gets the gold medal on a single arrow shoot off with a 10, just a 10 closer to the middle. So Zhao from China gets gold medal for the men's individual recurve and Netsiri from Thailand goes home with silver. Great way to finish the morning, the shoot off in the recurve men's open. <laughs> That's the end of our matches for this morning, and we will be back this afternoon at 1500, that's 3 p.m., with the compound teams for you. Um, so that'll be really exciting. We start off with the W1 teams, and we go right the way through in all of the W1 teams through this afternoon. So we'll see you later.